What's going on YouTube, Gios right here, so in today's video we're going to quickly discuss about iOS 14 beta and the check range jailbreak. There are of course a couple of reports in the community about this jailbreak not working properly on iOS 14 beta, but that was of course expected, I'm going to tell you what you need to do and of course what you should do if you want to jailbreak iOS 14 as soon as possible, because yes, it will be possible to jailbreak iOS 14 very very soon with check range. This video is brought to you by Wondershare and their software Dr. Phone, which allows you to transfer your photos, videos, music and messages from your iPhone to your computer. Check it out in the link below for both Windows and Mac OS. So as you probably know, Apple just released a couple of days ago the iOS 14 Beta 1. It looks amazing and it has a lot of UI improvements. From being able to like pin your widgets to your home screen like this and create tiles, it definitely looks a little bit like Windows Phone and that's something that I actually enjoyed in the past. It does have many, many features. You probably heard of it, finally we have a small smaller call bar for the iOS 14, it doesn't take the whole screen anymore when somebody calls you, which is basically like the call bar uh, tweak from the Cydia. And then of course you can group applications in the library like this with like bigger folders I think. And yeah, it does have a lot of UI changes, so it's definitely an iOS version that I can see people using in the near future. Now the beta 1 is available right now, you can find it if you want to, although it's a little bit hard to get, but um, the actual iOS 14 is coming this fall. So we still have a couple of months before this will be a stable iOS version and before all these features will be completely stable. But people already want to jailbreak it and it doesn't help that Jamie Bishop, part of the Checkrain jailbreak team, posted quote, it is going to be so awesome being jailbroken on day one of iOS 14. But Checkrain currently doesn't support iOS 14 beta as far as I know. Now why would we even think it would? Well you probably know that the exploit that Checkrain has cannot be patched, so even iOS 14 cannot patch the bootroom exploit in that jailbreak. However, the patches may change, and this is what happened this time. You probably know that the check range jailbreak does have an option button here, and there is an option to allow untested iOS or iPadOS or tvOS versions that if you press in here and go back, you would basically be able to jailbreak a version that is not necessarily supported by the check range here officially, because as you can see it says in here that the latest version added was 13. Point. Five. But with that option in here, we were even able to test and of course run check range jailbreak on 13.5.1, which is not necessarily supported by default. So that's a neat little feature that would allow you to test if the check range jailbreak works anyway on a version before they release it publicly. Now, the reason that happens is because from a version to another, there may not be changes big enough to actually break check range. Because check range requires a couple of kernel patches in order to work, aside from the checkmate exploit, but this time with iOS 4. 14 beta 1, the patches did indeed break and they need to redo them. So we have to wait for them to actually release a new version of check range soon, but I still do not recommend you to try it because the iOS 14 is a beta 1 software. If you update to it, you wouldn't be able to go back to 13.5, 13.4.1 and so on. The only version you would be able to go back to is 13.5.1. Now if you have a check range device that may not be a problem, 13.5.1 is unofficially supported, but if you have an uncovered device, you should definitely not update the 14 beta 1, because at first you wouldn't be able to jailbreak it with check range since the 812 and 813 devices are not supported, even if check range gets updated for 14, and then of course you wouldn't be able to go back to a jailbreakable version with Uncover. So definitely stay away from iOS 14 beta 1 for now, both for check range and for Uncover. It's not supported by either for the moment, and it's of course a beta 1 of a new major iOS version, so it's definitely bound to be buggy. Thank you for watching, I'm Geo Snow, till the next time, subscribe to stay updated and peace out!